Hey guys, it's your girl London and I am back with another video. Quick, simple, and easy brow tutorial. Beginner friendly, let's get started. First, we're gonna go in with the Maybelline Tattoo Studio and I'm gonna go ahead and just put that on my brows. And you just want to put it on to the desired length that you want and width that you want. Um, I just usually follow my natural brow and then I clean up the end. And with this guys, you just got to let it dry. It doesn't take long to dry between 30 seconds and a minute. Like, it's not that long. Okay, so the good thing about using this Maybelline Tattoo Studio is you don't have to put like any glue or anything on your brows because this actually dries and it keeps your brows in place. So that is a cool thing about this. I know a lot of people like to put like glue stick on their brows to keep them in place and stuff like that. Um, but with this, you don't have to do any of that because it already is a gel. So then I like to go in with my Q-tip and just like clean up my brows, you know, like, cause once it dries, baby, it's dry. <laughs> so you want to clean it up before it dries. So if you want to make any changes, do it now or forever hold your peace, okay? So I think I cleaned it up. I think that's good right there. I'm saying that's good, but yet I'm still touching it because I'm confused. I don't know yet. I'm still like, eh. Okay, now I think that's, I think that's good. And then what I do is go in with my little spoolie. And this is one that I got from um, Mary Kate where you can kind of like, you know, comb it out, get it to where you want it to be. And you want to make sure you comb upward. So comb upward and over. And then just clean it up if you need to. I have to get in the habit of telling myself my eyebrows are not twins, they're sisters, because I know you will go crazy trying to get them perfect. So that won't happen. They not twin sis, okay? They sis, they sisters, okay? So that's what I have to get out of my head because I always be wanting my brows to look the same and sometimes they don't, so that's okay. Uh, it's dry at this point, like literally nothing. So I'm gonna go in with my Anastasia and then I'm gonna go ahead and put some of that just to fill in my brows because Sis need a little help on the ends, okay? My brows, you know, they cute and all, but I still need to, you know, make them a little fuller. So take your time with this part because this is when you become an artist. You gotta like really map it out and draw it and make sure it looks even and stuff like that. So just take your time doing this part. And I like to use just certain things as just indicators on where to stop and where to continue. So that's why you might see this little mark right here, um, but it's gonna be gone. So don't, it's not staying there. Don't think it's gonna stay there. It's gonna be gone, girl. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and brush that. So I have more of a, you know, a natural blend need to go back to Target to get a few of these 
and I hope that they do have them because like I said before, when I went and purchased this, it was on sale. So I don't even know if they still have these, but I hope that they do um, because I really like the product itself and it's easy to come off. So I'm gonna go over here to my other girl. And I realized that this helps too if you like hold your brow up just a little at angle so that you can really define it a little more. If you make a mistake, ladies, it's fine. Get your Q-tip, wipe it away, brush it off. It's like it never happened. And that's what I'm starting to like see with doing makeup. It's okay to make mistakes. Like you learn from your mistakes, practice make perfect, you know, it is what it is. Like, if I make a if I make a mistake, I'm gonna continue doing what I'm doing. I, I won't be discouraged and stop. So that's another thing. Just because you mess up, don't don't stop trying. Okay? That's what I'm trying to say. Don't stop trying, sis. Alright? Don't stop trying. And remember, I told you guys in my other video, I learned this little technique that you like brush the middle part of your brows back and forth, back and forth. And that's what I'm doing right now so that they can like connect like a unibrow type. Um, so yeah, that's what you want to do. Like brush it back and forth, stroke, soft strokes. Make sure it obviously is aligned. Don't be all the way down here, you know. So just brush it back and forth. I've been like trying to find so many um, brow tutorials online and it's like, I can't find it. So I end up finding myself trying to like do things on my own because some of the brow tutorials, I just, I don't agree with, I guess, or it doesn't fit my style. So I just figured, you know what? Let me just make a brow tutorial for anybody that has brows like me that may want to know what to do. So this for you, okay? And I'm gonna go in with my LA Girl Pro Concealer and this is in the color Bond. This is my, I live by this concealer. I've been using this concealer for years, okay? So this is my go-to. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply that underneath my eye. And like I told you guys before, I like to use little dots just to guide me when I'm doing my underbrow. So I will make like one right here, one right there, one right there one right there and that's just so that I can really get in there and like clean it up really really good so okay we can breathe now. Woo. And I'm gonna go on top and do it. gonna move over to the other side and I'm gonna go on top Okay, so what you guys wanna do next is get a nice brush to blend that concealer out. And I'm just gonna use a, um, a fluffy brush and I'm gonna start blending my concealer into my skin, you know. You 
you want to make sure you are blending it very well okay and i'm also going to use more of a angled type brush um, just to get around that arch of my brow So these are the only two brushes I'm using for my brows right now, or that I will be using for my brows. Okay, and like I told you guys before, you could take either your two fingers or your thumb and just blend that middle part of your brows um so it won't be so harsh it will look more natural so that's what you're going to see me doing right now okay guys so this is the final results i hope you guys enjoyed this video like easy quick and simple brows to do girl you ready to put on your makeup you only needed what three different products like I'm telling you, quick and simple, ready to go. So this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And as always, treasure your family, treasure your time, and most importantly, treasure yourself. Peace.